Hello, I'm JT, and welcome to my channel. After watching Shane Dawson's conspiracy theory videos and all the drama concerning mundane Matt, I've been inspired to make this video. Turned the only interest I had in life into my into my job. Chills. I know what you're thinking. Tenfold hat, right? Well, then how do you explain this? Matt has pretty much become the skeptic community version of DSP. It even looks like him a little bit too. Except I think Matt. I would say Matt is actually probably takes care of himself more than uh, Dark Side Phil, but that's debatable. And uh, you know, prepare for what you're going to do when YouTube ends, or you're going to be Wings of Redemption. You're going to be DSP. Scared you're going to lose your house because your two mortgages are piling up. Digest a lot of uh, Monday Matt content, but if, if you just you know casually or somebody links you something like, what is this goofy shit he's saying? And they'll they'll link you, and you watch the video. It's clear he doesn't <laughs> he doesn't enjoy what he's doing. Like, you can just see it's just no. A he he's, he is wings of redemption. He is that guy that's yeah. stuck doing what he hates doing and scared shitless that it won't last. And here's the reality: it doesn't last for fucking anybody. Why are all these people on social media? Why do they all have a weight issue? And why are they all so angry? Call me fat on the fucking thing, cut! Fuck you! Oh Fuck you! Can I crack that? Dude, this is incredibly fucked up. Are you fucking kidding me? Can't do a ball. Can't do a fucking ball. Come on, man. I'm tired of this shit. You can handle your grievances with me like a real man, not a pussy behind a keyboard. Make it happen, because right now I'm putting you on blast and everyone sees how much of a fucking coward you are. Get in the ring, man. So what about Matt? Where does he fall into my theory? Because he's not actively angry. He's passively angry. What about Boogie? He has this weird, passive, active, aggressive nature to him. What is really going on? Well, not only do I think they are the same person, but I also think they are of a different age. A different timeline. So this is what I mean. Matt is the youngest, then is Rich of Revutech USA, then Darkside Full, then Boogie, and then lastly, Wings of Redemption. For now, don't look at their age. Look at their character, where it fits into the narrative. What is their narrative arc? We'll get back to the age a little bit later. Just think about it for a second. All these people make similar mistakes. Some in real life, some on YouTube. But there's a thread that binds them together. Another question I have is, is history bound to repeat itself? Each of them tried to hide these, let's call it bad moments that they bring upon themselves. Let's look at the timeline for further investigation. Mundane Matt is very young, struggling with his weight and trying to play the monetization game by getting ad block deactivated and desperately wanting to be a YouTube star. He is naive and unsure, so he plays it safe and tries to defeat his foes from the shadows because he doesn't have confidence. The older version, Rich of Review Tech USA, overweight, stopped having the dream of being a star, is more like a job now, complaining about YouTube more and is more aggressive than his Matt counterpart. Now for the sake of trying to misstep confusion, let's call this person that all these different characters inhabit, Person X, because it kind of sounds like sci-fi stuff. But let's continue. But this is interesting. The increased confidence, which will be important later in the timeline. His channel's layout is still very much the same. But with added skits, it still wasn't enough. Rich is losing views. His channel, once again, is a sinking ship. And speaking of Rich being a sinking ship, 
because there's no greater sinking ship than Dark Side Phil. At this stage of X's life, he's just clinging on. He is flat out just begging for money now and does even less effort in his videos. And his upload schedule has gone through the roof. Yes, Matt and Rich uploads at a very frequent basis. Low quality videos that are easier to make. But now we have entered a new realm. Spamming subs. But as with all stories, our hero has risen from the ashes. He made himself into a YouTube superstar. Boogie2988 a man that has lost the weight his Phil version picked up. But as of recent, his views and mental state has deteriorated once again. Phil was in a bad place, and yes, it got worse. And when he entered the stage of being Boogie2988, he thought, yes, finally, he has made it. But then as we all know, history is bound to repeat itself. Which brings us to X's final version, Wings of Redemption. The proof is in the name. It is X's final effort to be a YouTube superstar once again. To rise from the ashes once more. But sadly the weight is back. And his mental state is gone. He has given up, but does not know how to escape his fate. You're probably thinking to yourself, this is a bit of a stretch. How can all these people that look differently be the same? Yes, they have some similarities here and there, but how can they actually be the same person? Well, maybe, just maybe, they are from different multiverses. What proof do I have? The fan base. Don't you think it's strange that these YouTubers, more so than any other YouTuber, has dedicated channels to just criticize them. Almost like it doesn't matter how much you change, the reception remains the same. And would you want to go to a place where people treat you differently? But it doesn't matter where you go, history is bound to repeat itself. And that is why all these different people are on the same yet different path. But then how did they all get here? How do they get to our universe and how are they communicating with each other? Well, that's simple. What really happened to Wings of Redemption when he went to Mexico? Maybe my timeline is screwed up. Maybe none of this makes any sense. Maybe it's all true or maybe it's all a lie. Or maybe it's all just made because it's one big joke. But why are all these people losing views at the same time? Why do they all have some sort of mental issue? Why do they all have weight issues, anger issues, channels that are dedicated to them to just criticize them? And yes, even putting them side to side, there is a resemblance. Is a plastic surgery gone wrong to get away from all their haters? Or is there something in the future, something in these multiverses we have yet to see? Or does every multiverse person X look different? Or perhaps it's just some sort of glitch in the matrix.